Metro City, a well-known crime capital, has been ruled by violence and death for many years. A fact which the newly elected mayor and former street fighter Mike Hager plans to change. At the center of the problem is the huge gang known as Mad Gear. Mad Gear controls all of the major criminal activity in the city. When they learned of Hager's plans, they took immediate action to bring this new mayor under their control. Sometime in 1992. Hello, Mike Hager here. Hee hee hee, Mr. Hager. So pleased to make your acquaintance. I believe you know who I am. Don't hang up. We have a little business proposition for you. Your daughter for your cooperation. And we'll throw in the regular monthly bonus to your salary if we offered before. What? What happened to Jessica? Who is this? Not so fast, Mike. Turn on your TV. You son of a... What have you done to her? Nothing yet. But we'd enjoy the opportunity. Listen to reason, man. Why make your job difficult? Just let us do as we please, like the mayor before you did. Guy, Jessica was kidnapped. Jessica? My sweetheart since childhood. The Mad Gear must pay. She's my friend too. Count me in. Ooh, well, never thought I'd go back to an open boar game. With all that said, hey, how's it going, Fox Squad? My name is Akira Strix, or Trickster Fox, whichever you want to go with, and welcome to, well, another open boar game. This time, it's Hyper Final Fight by Mr. Q, if I remember correctly. He might go by a different username now, but this is a... This is, this is essentially like an open bore mod of the original Final Fight, which was supposed to be the original version of... Uh, Street Fighter 2 before the actual Street Fighter 2 came out. So, if you're familiar with the original Final Fight, then I don't need to explain anything. And the cutscene that you just saw should explain what the this game is going to be all about. There we go. Had to uh, change that first. And I'm going to turn on the cheats to turn on infinite lives because this game is kind of impossible without this turned on. Or at least it is for me. Look, don't judge me, okay? Besides, the reason that I decided to play this game is because with Street Fighter coming out soon, I... Uh, it's going to take place in Metro City, which is the setting of this game. So, without further ado, let us begin, shall we? Although, wait a second, before I get started properly, uh, I should mention that you might see Mission 1-0 and Mission 1-Alpha now, what is the difference between the two? Uh, Mission 1-0 basically has the, the soundtrack from the original arcade version of Final Fight 1, whereas the alpha version 
has the soundtrack from the Sega CD port. Which is what I'm going to be going with because uh, it doesn't hurt my ears. And what is Mission 2? Well, that'll be for another time. Right now we need to get through Mission 1 Alpha. Now as for playable characters, we have Cody, uh, ha Mike Hagar, or oh, sorry, Mike Hagar. It's Hagar, by the way, not Hagar. And Guy, who are already a part of the original Final Fight, but, but uh, some additions are Maki and Carlos from Final Fight 2, and I guess for some reason there's also the Street Fighter Alpha versions of both Cody and Guy, but also there's Guile, Feilong, and Kami from the Street Fighter series, but we're not going to be picking those characters. I'm going to be sticking with Cody, because, well, usually when I play the first Final Fight, Cody is the guy I go for. That's just me. Alright. So we need to fight our way through Metro City and get Jessica back. Okay, so, uh... <laughs> was fighting that sneeze, and I lost. So, because this is already a beat-em-up, well, we just have to fight through uh, a whole bunch of bad guys. Actually, let me go ahead and check the volume and the volume mixer really quick on this thing before I get started. Okay, just making sure. Ah. Ah. I really love I'm really enjoying the uh the soundtrack here because this is from, again this is from the this is from the uh, Sega CD version of Final Fight One and um, actually that's where the voice acting in the uh, introduction cutscene um, that's where that comes from it wasn't it wasn't the modder it wasn't the modder uh, voice acting for the uh, for the introduction there. And yeah, these guys don't mess around, which makes me happy that I, uh... Which makes me... Definitely makes me happy that I, uh... <laughs> that I, um... <laughs> that I turned on the Infinite Lives, uh, cheat, because, uh... Well, these guys are already wiping the floor with me, and, uh, well, we can't have that. I want to get through this game. And this is probably the third time in a row where I have come across the, uh, the Final Fight universe, or the Final Fight series. And I am going to be playing all of the Hyper Final Fight games. Like, there's this, there's, uh, Hyper Final Fight 2, and then there's Hyper, Hyper Final Fight 3. And, of course, we've got a bunch of enemies from, uh, the original Final Fight, with some mixed in from parts 2 and 3 as well. In fact, uh... I'm glad that this version has Poison and her palace swap, Roxy, in place of Billy and Sid, because, you know, a lot of people weren't happy with the idea of women, not even transvestites, uh, being beaten by dudes. Except you could totally fight girls in, uh, what was it, uh the Streets of Rage games, as well as, uh, 
Uh, as well as the original Double Dragon, so, uh... In those games, apparently, it's fair, but not here. I don't know. That's just... that's just weird to me. Besides, Poison and Roxy are clearly better, and you can't tell me otherwise. Oh, now these guys show up. And of course, like pretty much every beat-em-up ever made during the time that Final Fight came out, using, uh, using a special... using your special move uh, takes away a little bit of your health. Not too much, but just a tiny bit. I personally would not focus too much on I personally would not focus in this case too much on trying to get rid of every other mook. Just focus on the boss character, which is this guy, damned. And I do mean that because well, that is his name, apparently. Although, in the censored version of Final Fight 1, uh, that guy's name was Thrasher? And I think that's better, but that's just me. Because at least Thrasher sounds like a name, whereas Damned just doesn't. It just doesn't sound like it should be anyone's name. That's just dumb to me. But anyway, focus on Damned. Don't, don't focus too much on everyone else, because more enemies will just keep spawning regardless. Although I will get rid of Elgato, I don't like him. I always hate the knife throwers in the first final fight. <laughs> and then there's that grunt of defeat from Street Fighter 2. And then there's Stage 1. And that is where I'm going to end this part of Hyper Final Fight. So, if you guys want to see more of this, you have to, uh... Well, all you need to do is uh, leave a like and a comment. And also be sure to click the subscribe button if you want to see more content like this. And, always, and remember to click the notification bell so that you don't miss an upload from me so basically i'll be going through the hyper final fight series every friday in place of devil may cry 3 since dmc3 has basically been giving me a little bit of burnout which is why i gave up on it sorry uh but On Wednesdays, I will be going through the final, uh, not, uh, not the final fight, uh, No More Heroes 2, Desperate Struggle with Andrew. Every Friday will be a Hyper Final Fight video, and every Saturday I will stream, uh, whatever comes to mind that I actually want to stream. So, with all that said, I have been Akira Strix, or Trickster Fox, whichever you want to go with. Always remember to keep your gaming spirit alive, and if somebody you care about has ever been taken away from you, don't call the police. Go after the, go after the people who took your loved ones and beat the shit out of them. Don't kill them, but beat the shit out of them. With all that said, I will see you next week. For more Hyper Final Fight. Take care, Fox Squad.